The first poem is called Annunciation. Nothing will alter because a child is born. That was a fable. Any pregnant woman would savour the oatmeal of her ordinary loss with some such fabulous story as her time drew on. Why not throw in some angels with assault? It was the other part that the poor understood. Herod, the Roman magistrates, the cross. And what if all of it came from a fib? Warm nights when Mary slipped her quiet bed, trespassed across a courtyard, thought up a fine tale to father that strange love child in the crib. The prophets needed miracles. All followed on. Out of her faithlessness, a world of faith was bred. The Holy Roman Church, cross-natured Christendom. But would a thing as ordinary as a sly adultery have driven Herod wild? Her love had salt in it, savour of innocence no emperor could bear, an aromatic peace incensing the whole state which in its own defence drilled fabulous holy armies to deter a child from being born and kill it when it was. The other poem is called Mother and Child. She looks down, scarcely smiling as she has always done. In the road outside, horses and men troop past. A flight of birds disturbs the emperor's rest. In order to forestall those birds, the general set some murderous pomp and circumstance afoot. The eagle-headed standards eye her home. She is beyond the reach of imperial Rome. If she looked up, the child might fret. It is her calm that drives the emperor mad. Why is she looking down? Look to the all-in-one, high up aloft, ineffable, the abstract drum. She smiles, holding within the circle of her arm omens of innocence, a flight of birds, insurgent provinces, revolt within the state. Over the bowels of a bull, the priests deliberate. She has held the child too long to take alarm. She warms a growing world dependent on her milk. Why should she vex the infant's sleep or stir herself? She knows the emperor was suckled by a wolf. Were she to turn her head and look into the street, her child might scatter in a flight of birds. The door would be thrown down, the cradle would be full, horsemen and eagles, emperor, wolf and bull, and at her breast an empty drum would beat.